Okay, so let's try this one. How many moles of HCl are in 20 milliliters of 12 molar HCl? Okay, so what do we know? We know the volume, but we need the volume in liters. Okay? And we'll get to that in a second line. So we've got 20 mils. We know that one liter is 1,000 milliliters. Cancel that out. So we got 0 0.0200 liters of HCl. Okay. And the molarity is 12.0 molar. Okay. That also means, remember, molar means moles per liter. Okay, so we could also say 12.0 moles per one liter, like that. Okay. So we got to remember the equation for molarity. Molarity equals the number of moles of solute divided by the volume of solvent in liters. Okay. So we've got that, the volume, or the volume of solution, sorry. It's the volume of solution. We got the volume of solution in liters, and we've got the molarity. So we're trying to calculate this variable there, number of moles of solute, right? So we got to isolate that variable. So in order to do that, we got to get VL out of there. It's being divided there. So the inverse of division is multiplication. So when we multiply by both VL by both sides, cancels out like that. Okay, and we're left with the equation n equals VL times m. Does that make sense? Okay, cool. So. All we do now is plug in those numbers. Okay. So VL is 0 0.0200 liters. And um, the molarity is 12.0 moles divided by 1 liter. If you notice now, liters will cancel. Okay. Like that. And we get. 12 times 0 0.02, 0 0.24, and we've got 